Prince Harry's memoir, Spare, could become a feature-length movie. The possibility of Harry's story being told again could annoy critics. It's been rumored that the Duke of Sussex is looking to sell the rights to his book to a studio. But people are tired of hearing intimate details about his family life. Sources say Meghan and Harry are going too far when they want to invite director Francis Lawrence to come and adapt Spare into a blockbuster. They're looking for funding and have sent an open letter to Francis, but don't know when they're going to get a response, especially after their recent humiliation at the Emmy nominations. In the meanwhile, Francis Lawrence has been hard at work on developing the upcoming Bioshock adaptation. The feature film will be headed to Netflix, although details surrounding the project are still scarce. The director recently sat down with Collider, sharing his plans for the film and his love for video games from which the adaptation stems. What Megan's trying to do is seen as being hopeless. There's no way that big producers and directors will keep an eye on the spare memoir. They can smell failure a mile away. You've got the bestseller. But I would also argue that it doesn't even indicate that Harry and Meghan are popular, Miss Tognini said during a Sky News appearance. There are hate purchases in there. I know people who are like, I can't stand it, but I have to read it, so I don't necessarily think it's going to be a blockbuster. The shortlist for the Emmy ceremony, which is set to take place in September, was released yesterday, with the awards having 25 main categories, but more than 100 different ones in total. Shows eligible for the primetime Emmys must have been broadcast in the U.S. between June the 1st, 2022, and May the 21st, 2023. Couples documentary was not shortlisted which adds to the many blows the former senior royals seem to have suffered in recent times. The thinking on Meghan's part is that they'd owe it to themselves to fight back and make a success of things, however much that costs, and however challenging it may be in some cases, a source told a publication. She said the team that her new plan simply can't fail. The insider later explained that the suit star wanted to prove the haters wrong, she feels she's been backed into a corner. The insider admitted, her next move will be explosive, to say the least. Sussex's change of plans follows its recent failed partnership with Spotify. The greatest fear from Meghan and Harry's perspective is that this latest controversy and criticism could be the straw that breaks the camel's back when it comes to what the public thinks of them and how much money they can earn, the source explained. Things may have to change as far as joint appearances go. And indeed, it seems like bashing the rules together is off the agenda now for this foreseeable future. They later revealed the suit star was left disappointed by the negative commentary she received for the cancellation of archetypes.